Hey guys, Game Justin here today. We have this controller. Got it off Amazon. It's the wireless Bluetooth gamepad. It doesn't actually say who it's by. Uh, it says W18 on the top. I don't know who's it by. It doesn't say, but we have it. So that's the thing. Um, we're going to be opening it today. I'll have the link to where I got this in the description. If you guys want it, we're going to do a full review. Let's just start. Let's go with this and put that in. There we go. That's the product. So now we'll open it. Um, I don't know how to open this. Wait. Oh, okay. I was doing it backwards. Okay. So I'm going to show you guys that controller. So this is the controller. Let's see how this feels. Feels great. It has a stand which you can put your mobile device on. That's why I got this so I can. This Fortnite mobile got controller support, so I figured let's get a controller. So yeah, this is the controller. I'm just gonna put that right there. We have a little bit of plastic for the controller. On the floor, a charger for the controller that's important, and a manual. Oh, it's dead. Okay, so I'm gonna charge this and then I'll meet you guys back where we'll be testing it inside of Fortnite. Okay, guys, so we're gonna, we're launching into the game. Um, I have actually seen no indication so far that this controller is working. Turns out it actually wasn't dead, and it was more of a the the red light was a, a pairing light and not a um. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so actually I'm on the wrong count. But so far, it's looking good. So you can't switch using touch screen after you use controller. That's understandable. That's fine. But it actually looks like... Like, I'm on, like, a console. Like, a mini console. I... I like this controller. This controller feels nice. I mean, nothing's ever gonna beat a normal Xbox controller, but... But, I mean, this feels... Ah, no! I forgot I'm playing with mobile people. Oh no, I can't enable auto run. Okay. Again, I have to go through the settings and modify some things, but. Stop it! Oh my gosh, I died. That's amazing. But this, I, I like this. This feels nice. So there's one thing we're gonna try real quick. So obviously I know once you queue into with a controller, you cannot switch to using touchscreen. I'm gonna try the other way around. So if I queue in using touchscreen, will it let me use the controller in game? Yeah, no, it won't. It says input blocked on the screen. Okay, so one thing I've noticed also with the controller is that you have to use the limited controls because you cannot press down the joysticks. They don't do anything when you press them down. So when going through your controls, just make sure you have the limited option set. You also have to get used to the new layout. Sorry. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, drop a like, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you all later. Goodbye.